What are the ethical considerations when dating a third cousin? Hello there. Today, we're delving into a topic that might not be common dinner table conversation, but is nonetheless important to discuss, the ethical considerations of dating a third cousin. It's a complex issue and involves understanding personal beliefs, societal norms, and even some genetics. Remember, ethics are a personal matter, and while we will provide an overview of potential considerations, ultimately, your own moral compass will guide your decisions. What does third cousin mean? Before we delve into the ethical issues, let's first understand what it means to be a third cousin. This term refers to the children of your second cousins, meaning you share great-great-grandparents. In terms of genetic relatedness, third cousins typically share about 0.78% of their DNA. Ethical Considerations from a Societal Perspective while all societies have norms and standards regarding relationships between relatives, these norms vary widely. Some societies consider relationships between third cousins completely acceptable, while others may frown upon it. The key ethical issue here is understanding societal expectations and norms, as ignoring these could potentially lead to social consequences or stigmatization. Personal Ethical Considerations the ethics of dating a third cousin also depends on personal values and beliefs. For some, the familial connection, even if distant, may feel uncomfortable or inappropriate. For others, the distance in the familial relation may not be a significant concern. Being truthful and transparent about the nature of the relationship to all involved parties, including family members, is essential to maintain honesty and integrity, two critical components of ethics. Genetic Considerations While third cousins share a minimal amount of genetic material, there is a small increase in potential genetic risks for offspring compared to unrelated individuals. However, this risk is still relatively low, and many would argue it's not significant enough to be a major ethical concern. Awareness of potential genetic risks can influence the decision-making process, and consulting a genetic counselor could provide valuable information if the relationship becomes serious. In conclusion, the ethical considerations when dating a third cousin are multifaceted, involving societal norms, personal beliefs, and genetic factors. There is no universally correct answer, as ethical decisions are often deeply personal. We hope this video has provided you with some valuable insights to reflect upon. Remember, the most important thing is to be comfortable with and confident in your own decisions.